Seed treatments can help growers protect their cereal crops, such as wheat and barley, from a variety of yield-robbing pests and disease. But seed treatments are not as widely used in cereal crops compared to corn and soybeans. Cereal growers may perceive seed treatments as an extra input that they don't really need, only later realizing that a seed treatment could have helped. I think all cereal growers should be thinking about using a seed treatment all the time because it's like everything in life. If you start out in the right way and get going in a good healthy way and you start your crop in a good healthy way, you're going to end up with a better stand, better vigorous crop and better yields. And the idea behind a seed treatment is to apply it to the seed to protect the seed from either diseases that are already on the seed or to apply it to the seed to protect from soil borne diseases or insects that could be within the soil profile. What a grower would expect to see when he's using a seed treatment in his enterprise is that he's going to have a more uniform emergence of his wheat. He's going to have more plants that are going to emerge within a square foot, for example, or a square yard. And ultimately what that means, if you have more plants, you get quicker emergence, you get better vigor. Raxel Pro Shield by Bayer launched in North Dakota and Montana, where spring wheat, winter wheat, Durham and barley are popular cereal crops grown. Seed treatments using Raxel Pro Shield can help protect these cereal crops against a variety of smut, fusarium or head scab, multiple varieties of root rot, early season septoria, and more. Seed treatments have changed over the years in that uh, a lot of products are now combinations of fungicides and insecticides. Formulations have changed. There's been some new active ingredients put into the seed treatments. Raxel Pro Shield for example, for the combination of three fungicides and an insecticide, and it's, it's formulated as a microdispersion, which is a very easy to use formulation in cold or warm weather. It mixes well, goes on to the seed very well, and gives you a nice finished seed. From a fungicide standpoint, Raxel Pro Shield has prothioconazole, tebuconazole, and metalaxyl. These active ingredients complement each other as they work together to combat soil and seedborne fungal diseases. Plus, Raxel Pro Shield includes the insecticide imidacloprid at a higher rate than most other seed treatments. This helps protect seedlings from wireworms, for example, which have become more of a problem in this geography. So when you have some downtime in the spring, before you're ready to go to the field, obviously, you can treat your wheat and store it in a bin, or in, in a lot of cases with the Raxel Pro Shield formulation, which is very easy to use, either have it commercially treated or you can do it on the farm yourself. You can also treat it as it's going into the holding tank for the planter. Many growers have also said that Raxel Pro Shield handles well, is easy to use in already mixed form, goes on seed uniformly and sticks well to lessen dusting. Some seed treatments, after you apply and you have it in your, your truck, for example, when you empty it, you have a lot of pink or colored material left in the truck. And we don't, we don't hear comments about that with Raxel Pro Shield. It's not a clay-based formulation. So in that sense, then, the, the commercial treaters, it works better in the commercial treaters. They're not having to clean and unplug their treaters as regularly. So it, it flows through treaters very well. Growers can contact their local Bayer representative or visit cropscience.bear.us for more information about Raxel Pro Shield.